All right, on the um, all right for those of you who listen to this podcast religiously or maybe caught the last one, um, I was asking like how that expression came about because I brought it up in the writer's room. I used uh, for F is for family. I was talking about uh, it's on the arm, and there was a number of people that had never heard that expression. And I said, well, it means yeah, it means it's free. You don't have to pay for it. Um, and then when I was looking it up, trying to figure out where it came from, it said it was a, a, um, it came from like law enforcement or whatever. But evidently I was wrong because someone else went to another part of the internet and they came up with this. It said, Bill, here's what the internet said about on the arm, or here's what you found that it said. Cause what I found that it said was about, it was from, came from the fucking law enforcement. He, this person says, uh, to show their respects to the mafia boss, who protected their neighborhood um, or fear of being extorted, the store owners would not allow them to pay for items. Well, if you're afraid that you're going to be extorted, I don't think that like bowing down to somebody, you should make them fucking pay for it, I would think. But anyways, um, the store owners would take their right hand and brush it against their left arm as a way of saying, forget about it, no charge, free. All right. Well, where I looked at it, that it came, it came from law enforcement. The, the, the cops wouldn't pay for stuff. I don't know. You, who the fuck knows? It's the Internet. You don't know what's true. You don't know what isn't, right? How far did you look? How far onto the Internet did you go? I'm going to see how far it took me to get. Okay, on the arm. Here we go. On the arm. Origin. Come on, man. Come on, Internet. Work for me. On the arm. Any idea to its origin? Is it that the police might have threatened with his gun? I doubt it, but I'm just trying to figure out. This is what I get. That's the first one. The first one is just one of these. What, what are these fucking chat rooms, by the way? And who, and who are these people in them? Where are these things? How do you chime into these things? You got to sign in them. I'm on like wordreference.com. And this guy just writes, or this woman writes, Hi there, I heard the phrase on the arm in the movie Donnie Brasco about a mafia guy, Al Pacino, as an undercover policeman, parentheses, Johnny Depp. Is the movie that old? He could have just said fucking Donnie Brasco. People know who's in it. I learned that it's police lingo for free of charge. Any idea as to its origin? Is it that the policeman might have threatened with his gun I doubt it but I'm just trying to figure out the arm in there like why would you present a theory and then doubt your own fucking theory um here was what the people's response was okay dictionary to reference somebody has this you click on this arm the upper limb of the human body, especially part extending from the shoulder. <laughs> this is serious. The upper limb from the shoulder, the, other, the forearm, the limb, the vertebrae, any arm like attachment. An administrative or operational branch of an organization. An arm and a leg is a great deal of money. Uh, arm and arm. Arms linked together, and arm's length. On the arm. Uh, slang, free of charge, an investigation of policemen who ate lunch on the arm. Uh, put the arm on to solicit or borrow money from. She put the arm on me for a generous contribution to force or use violence on. You strong arm. I, you know what? I don't even give a shit. This is what happens. By the time I get to this part of the Internet, I say, I don't fucking care. And there's usually something I can click on in the side, like, oh, look at Tyson. Keep it real. Keep it Tyson. Check them out. I guess it's some sort of fucking lunch meat. Luxury. Now, what about me fucking, I guess because it's on the arm, like they think somebody wants a free sandwich? Catch it at a store near you. Some giant fish. Oh, word of the day. Highfalutin. That's a word? I thought that was just something you, you sent me sandwich, say. Dag burn highfalutin varmint. Um, Dominic was at the back at a back table talking to a suited man in the sombre. 
in the somber, highfalutin English he put on for, for people of stature. Oh, it's like Madonna. In this case, probably the noodle salesman. I have no idea what that sentence meant, and I, I, I probably mispronounced most of it. Madonna puts on the fake accent. You know, why does she not act like she's just some white trash chick from Detroit? She's got that stupid English accent now. Um, borderline. Still love that song.